guys out of the living head. We're going to show you how we make our breakfast pizza this morning. Are you ready? We're ready. Yeah! Alright guys, first step, we're going to take four eggs, break them open, scramble them up. There we go. Alright, number one. Let's do number two. Number three. Number four, the last one. Now we need to scramble them. Look at that. We didn't even get any shells in there. All right. Get stirring. That'll help. Keep the yolks up good. Finish stirring for us. in a minute. Finish stirring up. I'm going to set that aside for now. And we'll be right back to show you the next step. Alright, guys, now we've got to clean our hands up and our mess. The eggs kind of get out of control, but that's the whole fun of it. We've got to dry the table and our hands off pretty good. Set the eggs aside. The eggshells will get rid of for now. Hey, dry the table off. Dry the table off with the other one. Alright, here comes the fun, messy pot. If your mom doesn't like you making a mess, don't let her watch. Tell her to go to the other room. Right? Yeah. Alright, hold on, we got the flour out. Take some flour, spread it out. Put your hands in it. So your hands don't get sticky from the dough. The purpose of the flour is so the dough doesn't stick to your hands or whatever you're rolling it out on. Yeah, that's what I already said. Yeah, we're going to do ours right on top of the pizza stone, if that's what we have. If you don't have a pizza stone, roll it out on the table and then put it on a cookie sheet. We're going to get the dough out of the bag. This is really hard to get out. I'm just taking off the rest of it out. Ew! This is all garbage. <gasps> I just... Ew. I've never done that before. I think I need more flour. Put your dough down. Sprinkle a little bit of flour on it. You can feel your dough is sticky, so you want to kind of get that stickiness off. Yeah, so your hands don't stick to it, or it, it sure stick to you. Yeah. Take your rolling pin, cover that with flour. <laughs> Try to roll out the pizza dough as best as we can. We buy our pizza dough already made. You can make it yourself. It's pretty simple. It's just basically flour, yeast, and water. But, oh, you popped the bubble. Mm -hmm. I just really want to pop the bubbles. I got another big one over here for you. Yeah. Good thing we washed our hands first. Yeah, so I could play with the bubbles. Pizza. Yeah. So we roll it out the best we can in a circle, which don't always happen. Yeah. It just goes in the middle. You need to preheat your oven to 450. While that's preheating, you can do this part. What? Do this part. What? 
get a preheat your oven so it gets up to temperature. You want to do that before you make the pizza. Or while you're making the pizza, so that way it's nice and hot when you're ready to go put the pizza in the oven. What's the matter? You give up on rolling off the big one? Yeah, I want a little mini one. You're going to need your hand in a minute. Oh, okay. Right, now we're going to go around and kind of fluff up the crust so we kind of have a bowl to set the egg in. Yeah, so they don't. So he doesn't splash out. You don't want the egg. And if it, they come undone, we just do it again. Because we keep on going around. Try to stretch it as we go. Yeah, so you pinch and stretch. That's what I'm doing. But if it breaks, just do it with it while you're doing it. Try rolling it out some more. Yeah. And then I make my little crust, and my little pizza. Cause I'm gonna put like maybe a little bit of it in there. Yeah, boy, you're making a mess. Yeah. Like eggs. Some of it. Our pizza dough is starting to stick to our pizza stone, so I'm gonna put a little bit more flour down. Not a bad idea to check every once in a while. I mean. Just a little bit of that too. I can lift up my. Alright, so now I got the pizza dough in the best circle shape you can get it. You pour the egg in. Hey, can I help? Pour the egg in? You can help me spread it. Okay. I'll spread it. You don't want to go too much. Because the egg is going to rise and you still have whatever toppings you want to put in your pizza. Yeah, you, we, we like to put, um... Today we're going to do sausage and cheese. Yeah, we always do sausages and cheese and eggs. We always do eggs. We, can, yeah. we do bacon sometimes, whatever yeah. we have left over. Last night we had breakfast for dinner. And we had sausage left over. <laughs> So now we're going to sprinkle in the sausage. I cut them up last night. Because the cheese goes on after. I'm going to spread them out pretty good. Yeah, and we're probably going to be able to. This is six sausage links diced up. You could put vegetables in here, you could do whatever you want. Yeah, because it could be a vegetable pizza. Yeah, you could do vegetables. Some people like vegetables in their eggs. We're more of a meat and meat family. Yeah. Daddy, can you please cook this for me? And I want to do it all on. Then we take the cheese, the fun pot. Yeah, the fun pot. Spread See, this out evenly and be generous. Yes, you just sprinkle the cheese out just like this. Don't spread it too much. And you just put it on top of the sausage. You might need all of this up. Don't worry. Put a little bit too much egg in there. It's starting to ooze out. So we got to try to build the crust up over here a little bit. Yeah, on top of it mostly. So just when you put the cheese on, don't squish it down. Don't pat it. Just. Okay. Okay. What do you want to do with that sauce? What? You want to do with that sauce? You get cooked. Don't pat. So we used about half a package of cheese. And that was a 12 ounce package. So we used about six ounces of cheese. We 
probably use three eggs, one package of pizza dough. Preheated the oven to 450. Now we'll, we're going to wipe this Can down, clean this up a little bit, and we'll be back in a minute. There it is. Talk about 15 minutes to cook it on 450. Daddy, look at it. Yep. Look at all this stuff. Here's the pizza all cooked. Now we're going to slice it. And dice it. And dice it, all right. <laughs> I, 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 that's like a rhyming thing. I feel like I hear people saying, so I just say, slice, slice it and dice it. There you go. Oh, that looks like a meal. Yes. Yeah, looks it's like a, a pie, huh? Yeah. It's your pizza pie. Let it cool for a few minutes, and breakfast is ready. And then you can eat it. 